Natural Remedies for Seasonal Allergies Seasonal allergies are an exaggerated reaction of the immune system that occurs when a foreign substance shows up in the body, such as allergens. These substances don't affect the majority of the population. However, there are some people with allergies that have immediate reactions when they come in contact with them. Among the most common seasonal allergies, the ones that stand out are rhinitis, conjunctivitis and asthma. Pollen allergy. Trees and plants are pollinated during different seasons. However, grasses are a plant that tends to provoke allergies. The allergen concentration found in pollen tends to be more elevated on dry and hot days when the wind is blowing. Symptoms. Rhinitis. Rhinitis often appears in children. If it's not treated, the symptoms get worse. Rhinitis is the inflammation of nasal mucus. The patient experiences. Nasal obstruction excessive secretion itching sneezing. On occasion, you can also experience watery and red eyes. Seasonal rhinitis affects the airways because of the pollen. Asthma. In some cases, a patient can experience an asthma attack and have problems breathing, tightness in the thorax and a cough. This can happen when plants start their flowering whether that be in the summer or the spring. However, the patient typically doesn't have symptoms the rest of the year. This can affect people at any age. Conjunctivitis This is the inflammation of the membrane that surrounds the surface of your eye and the inside of your eyelids. It occurs when the patient is exposed to an allergen. It can be accompanied by rhinitis or asthma. The allergens that tend to cause conjunctivitis are Pollen dust mites animal fur fungi cosmetics antibiotics. Natural remedies. Mint nettle tea. In general, any hot tea works as an expectorant. This means it fights congestion that forms in the mucous membranes. Particularly, mint contains a component that helps to stop the secretion caused by the histamine. Meanwhile, nettle is an antihistamine that reduces allergy symptoms. Ingredients One tablespoon of dried mint, 10 grams, one tablespoon of honey. 25 grams, a cup of water, 250 milliliters, 1 tablespoon of nettle, 10 grams. Preparation
Start by putting the water in a pot and boiling it. Then, add the mint leaves and nettle. Let boil for 10 minutes and inhale the vapor that is coming from it. Finally, sweeten with honey and drink it as tea. Saline Solution Nasal washes are one of the oldest and most effective methods to clean out pollen, mites and any residue that accumulates in the nasal passageways. In addition to cleaning the area, they also prevent infections. Ingredients One cup of distilled water, 250 milliliters one half tablespoon salt, 5 grams, one pinch of baking soda. Utensils. One dropper. Preparation. First, heat the distilled water without letting it boil. Then, add the salt and baking soda. Combine until all of the ingredients are well mixed. Let it cool. Then, pour the mixture into a dropper and put one drop in each nostril. Finally, repeat this procedure three times a day. Herb Extract Vaporization Inhaling vapor helps to remove mucus and calm irritation in the nostrils. As a result, the allergy symptoms decrease. Ingredients One cup of water, 250 milliliters, four drops of essential oil, rosemary, mint or eucalyptus. Preparation First, boil the water and add the drops of oil. Then, cover your head with a towel, leaving your face uncovered. Carefully lean into the infusion, inhaling the vapor and slowly exhaling. Repeat this procedure for 10 minutes. To finish, blow your nose. Preventative methods Remove unnecessary objects from your bedroom. Books, toys, flowers. Keep the house ventilated in the morning and close the windows in the afternoon. Wash and dry your hair before going to bed. Avoid smoking or being around smokers. Don't expose yourself to strong odors like perfumes or deodorants. Clean the blades of your fans. Keep your pets out of the house. It's very important to clean your furniture, lamps and picture frames every day. Avoid using feather rugs and pillows.
Line your mattress with a plastic cover and put it out in the sun once a week. Wear cotton pajamas instead of wool.